known as Chaos Blur, here to introduce all of you streamers and streamers to the latest, the greatest Crash Bandicoot game coming out this October, October 2nd, not too far away. And very fittingly, it's called Crash 4, It's About Time. And yeah, I am very excited to take a look at the demo today, just released, uh, well, literally today, only for people who pre-ordered the game, which I think is a bit of a lousy move, but I was going to buy it anyway, so I don't feel bad about buying it, and actually, you know, now I'm just going to be ready to stream the whole game in about a couple weeks. But for today, just going to look at the demo, uh, a few levels, a few of them I've even seen a good amount of, so we're going to see what Activision's come up with here for the Crash sequel. And to say that I'm excited about this game is a bit of an underrated statement, or an understatement. I forgot the word for that for a second. But no, there, there really haven't been too many games that I'm super looking forward to this year. And this is probably the one, maybe even the only, that I'm really looking forward to. Because as I mentioned before, uh, 3D platformers are my favorite genre. Uh, even though I love my 2D platformers, I love my old school Sonic and whatnot. 3D platformers, I think, have a lot of potential still. And I'd love to see projects like this come out. Of course, this is a sequel to the Crash Insane Trilogy, which saw... Well, I'm going to be quiet and see if they have anything here for the beginning. It's a pretty simple opening. I was kind of hoping it would be like the Insane Trilogy where they had that announcer guy come on and be like, back again, it's Crash Bandicoot. But, uh, you know, a little funny intro sequence there. I kind of figured there wouldn't be much. It's just the demo. You can hear that Crash type of music there. you got to be kidding me. I need to read all this for a freaking demo. Yes, 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 I promise not to sue. Seriously? What if I decline? Oh, privacy policy. Well, I'm streaming this on the internet, so I'm not too worried about privacy. Alright, so we got three levels here. Snow Way Out, Dino Dash, and Ship Happens. I feel like they're cutting it kind of close with that pun. Uh, that's a little, little adult, I think. Funny enough, I, I feel like Snow Way Out was the name of a level in another Crash game. I could be wrong, uh, like another ice level, but let's just, let's just do them in order. This is Snow Way Out. Okay, I'm going to take my time here whenever it loads. Kind of just see what we're working with. My first time playing the game. I've seen footage of it. Crash Bandicoot. You banished me to the past. But all it did was give me more time to plan your doom. You'll find me up the mountain. Don't freeze on the way. Well, you know, I'm, I'm sensing a real fraught history here. How many times have you beaten this clown anyway? Three. Really? Only three? <laughs> funny. Seemed like more. All right, it's a pretty funny cutscene there. Of course, referencing the fact that um, even though this is Crash 4, there have technically been like, I don't know the exact number of Crash games, but uh, there have been some other ones. Some that were not exactly high quality, let's say. So I'm just kind of getting a feel for the controls. There's nothing back here, it doesn't look like. No, no hidden secrets or anything. Really, I mean, they changed the look a little bit, but it controls very similar to, similarly to the Crash, uh, what do you call it, uh, Insane Trilogy. Maybe your feet are a little slippery here from the ice. Nice touch. So this is one of the new masks they have. How do I... That slows down time. Okay. I've seen this done in other demos. I don't know what the point of it is. 
Okay, well that that was fun. <laughs> that was good good game. Okay, I'm like brown pad. Oh jeez, I almost fell in the freaking water again. Not really a completionist, like I don't really oops, I don't really care if I get all these or not. Okay, so I don't have to hold the button down to, to slow down time. I just have to hit it. Controls are really good. Right. First thing I noticed. Is I, I've watched plenty of gameplay, but until you really get behind the wheel of it, so to speak, you don't know. I thought I got it. Don't crash too hard, hey oh. Just wondering how long until that button would be made. Why how do I stop these guys now? That's not how. The old angel animation's back. So instead of lives, it just kind of shows you how many times you died. That guy just hit a freaking TNT crate. Lovely. <laughs> it lasted about a second. Why would they spawn me that close to where the spears are? Oh no, the, the game, I mean, I literally played maybe a minute of it. Oh crap, 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 crap. Ah, I just watched my own death in slow motion. Knock these away? I don't know how I'm supposed to beat that guy if I wanted to. I like that. Okay, so maybe this is where I can use my slowdown power. Or I can just not do it. That's gonna explode. Goes from right to left there. Yeah, well, I don't know. There's probably a better way to do that. I think I could slide. Yeah, I got to slide. I mean, I am in a park, and I am walking. It's always been a weird, like, hit detection type of issue in Crash. This is a little bit better, but I still feel like there are times where I'm hitting stuff. I kind of just cheese that, but whatever. Uh, looks like we got a bonus level here. I am Captain Platformer. I love platformers. I hit the wrong button, clearly. I just nitrified myself. Okay, so if I use the slow down thingy. Kind of weird on that. Oh god! Oh, oh okay, I mean. Oh crap! 
I hate that that's the same button. And yes, you do. I think it's Ship Happens plays uh, Cortex, which is the third level of this demo. I'm gonna try this one more time. I, I never got too into the bonus rounds. Like, I know some people try to 100% them. It's a freaking bonus round. I'm dying in the bonus round. So you hit that. You hit that. You don't do that. Pulsing. Like I said, there's not even lives in this particular version. You can do lives in the main game, or you can just have it, you know, keep a death counter like it's doing now. I'm still an old school. I enjoy my lives. That way I know just how bad I suck. I did not know there was a gap behind him. I thought I could just jump right over creepy spike guy. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, he spins like a top when you knock him away. Like, he did, that was pretty cool. Sure. I'm sure my 560p stream, it's nothing that impressive. Uh-oh. But it actually looks pretty good on my 1080p TV screen. 540, whatever. Whatever I'm working with, it looks twice as good on a real TV. Crap. Ten deaths. That actually is kind of fun to do. I look forward to seeing what other power-ups they have in the game. Some kind of videotape or something? I can't collect it. So they got crates to shoot fire out of them now, that's new. Ah, oh, see, that's what I mean. I missed that jump by like an inch. Break it. Oh, literally did the same thing again. It's almost like the craft designers know what mistakes you're gonna make and they make sure to put everything in exactly that place. Like they know everyone's gonna try to over jump that platform, so they're like, let's have it move just slow enough. That's ice. That's ice. <laughs> oh, even when he dies, he charms us. Oh. See, I wish he had like a ledge grab or something. I could swear he used to have a ledge grab. Not have a ledge grab. He does not have a ledge grab. He does not have a ledge grab. Maybe he gets one later. I don't know.
Oh, Too fast. Did I mention he doesn't have a ledge grab? I don't think he has one, that's just my take on it. Wanna reach 287? I mean in this level or in general, because it's probably gonna be close. Nah, it's not gonna work. I, I gotta wait until they're lower. As I do the opposite. Spider-Man when you need him. See, if I, was, if I was too good at the game, it would discourage people. They'd be like, oh, it's too easy, I don't want it. So I'm trying to, you know, make it look like it's more of a challenge. That way, you know, people are more interested in challenges. Oh, I was so close to the checkpoint. Ah, why is it the same button? I do like the other, I like the uh, time mask though. I don't like that I can't use it, but I like that it's there. I you gotta be so fast there. That's the problem. It's gotta be like a like it's probably a slide jump to do it. They definitely made this harder than Crash 3, which I thought was the easiest one. I mean, it was still hard, but it was a lot easier than this. that again in 3D. Test my depth perception. hey -o. All right, Bex, you're on fire today. How long have you been saving some of these? Okay, in case you wondered why I did that, it's because that platform was going to collapse, so I was kind of screwed.
Oh, oh okay, I was gonna say, the next one's way too far. Ugh. So you really don't need to double jump on those. A lot of them are within range of the regular jump. I end up overcompensating. That one, we need to double jump for. Music. It's got that mysterious, like, crash atmosphere. Okay, nitro crates. I missed a lot of freaking crates. See, that wasn't so hard. See, look how happy he is. He's so happy. First 22 tries. Oh, I can pick a play style. Retro, modern. I think retro is the one that once you run out of lives, you get a game over, which I'm not in the mood for that right now, based on that. Ship, I, I, that's what I said. I'm like, isn't that a little risky for a kid's game? And calling it Ship Happens? I'm not a kid's game, but it's not like a. I don't know. I think it's funny. All right, let's get prehistoric here. I think I already know I'm gonna get chased by a dinosaur here. Oh yeah. Can't forget about Boulder Dash and all those. I always love bouncing on these boxes. Oh god, I hate the ones where you ride on something, because even if you hit like a pebble, the thing goes flying oops, the thing goes flying off the rails, and it's like, all I did was hit a pebble. Like, why did I die that quickly? I'm like, just because my lizard or whatever died doesn't mean I should. My fault, but got, you know, eaten or whatever. Oh, shoot. I got it. a lot like the Insane Trilogy. It feels a little different, which is fine with me. I'm actually glad they didn't just copy and paste that. These dinosaurs are like, gee, I hope we're not used as a platform in a game. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't even know what to say to that. I hope these are both later levels in the game, because you know, these are pretty hard if they're like the first two levels of the game. Oh, almost got like a three for there. Alright, 
There's another one. Oh, I see. Well, sorry, that means that nitro crate can't hurt me, right? It's not really there? Okay, good. That's a, that's a different ability. That's almost like the P-switches in Mario. So this, I believe, is... Uh, yeah, this is uh, going to be a rail grindy sequence. Okay, how do I go underneath? I thought there was a way to, like, switch to go underneath the thing. So that that doesn't happen. Controls here. Other than jump and that. That was a mushroom. Why did they hit it like it was a rock wall? Ha! Huh, you can't get me, Nitro. You're not real. Oh, now you are. Now you're not. Now you are. Now you're not. It's kinda, I, I know there's a way to go underneath the rail. They don't give me controls for that. Hold on. Oh, it's circle. Okay. Well, at least now I know it's circle. Circle goes underneath the rail. You can just tell me that. You can tell me everything else. That's a dinosaur. Saw that coming. Too bad. Kind of getting used to that whole, you know, not seeing what's coming thing from playing the other Crash games. I can see the camera angle changing right now. Yep, that's what I figured. Oh crap, he's got a friend! Come on, go, 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 go! Seriously, why is he knocked out? Go, you idiot! Oh, why did he have the stars on him? I couldn't move. God, he's got a lot of friends. I knew at one point or another I was going to miss those platforms. That's one thing I suck at, is hitting moving platforms from that angle. Now, this just seems unreasonable. We don't need all these dinosaurs. Don't they have anything better to do?
say it's not going to be over that easily. Oh jeez, I didn't realize I wasn't going to break. Oh jeez, ouch! Okay, that's that's my butt. It's on fire. My butt is on fire. Please break. Oh, this is actually kind of annoying. This is worse than the dinosaur. get under that and also not touch the lava. Come on, Activision. It's instant death, too. It doesn't even matter if I have an Aku Aku. Doesn't even matter if I have two Aku Akus. This is a lot harder than Warped, which was not a super hard game. This is more like Crash 2, which was a very hard game. Ugh. I can't jump over that thing, I've tried. First time, like I, I did it already. I've gone, I've gone under those things before. Okay, I think I've got to time it so that just as it's passing under the tunnel, I've got to do the slide. Oh, I got invincibility now. That's wonderful. about crash games too even like when you think you figured it out you're like oh, okay that's what i do then they like throw a little wrinkle into that pattern so it's like okay yeah you, you knew what to do before but now we just put like another thing there see like right there that's it's a longer jump and i see the tnt crate on the other side of it so yeah my strategy will work for a couple of attempts but and they're like, oh yeah, wise guy, do this. Okay, so I actually gotta slow down a little bit. Oh, no, I can't. I can't slow down because that'll happen. I wish that platform moved a little faster. Is that 27 deaths now? Mm, I knew I had no chance there.
best part is, I bet there's levels in this game even tougher than this. Like, there's probably gonna be another, like, floating bridge level or something where you gotta, like, step on little stones or you fall off or something. The platform's cleared the tunnel, you're too late. You gotta hit it like right. No, nope, not like that. You gotta get it right as it's in the middle. Nope, too late. Then of course you got the lava bubbles. Nope, too too soon? I don't know. I hate this so much. It's one of those levels I'm gonna avoid after I beat it the first time. If I ever do. Oh god, you gotta be kidding me. I used to be able to at least get past this. Oh. Joke's on you guys, I like lava. I like lava. I don't care who knows it. idea there. It looks like that's the last one, too, and then it goes to another part of the level. <clears throat> that first one's not even hard. I don't know why I keep screwing that up. Alright, just gotta take a deep breath. Crash dude here. Don't, don't jump on the first one. Don't jump on the second one. Son of a bitch. Nope, 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 nope. Not gonna work. Timing on this is so ridiculous. Try a single jump. Nope, not strong enough. Although, we could help them. Single slide jump, maybe? Hmm, single slide jump seems to be a better option. At least for some of it. I lied, there is no good option to this. It's, it's completely arbitrary. So there, there's just, you just have to hope that you get lucky a couple times. I think the invincibility mask is screwing me up. I think it makes him a little faster, which is not helping me. I'll try it without it. Because I'm doing so great with it. This is making me sad. I mean, I like the level. Like, it looks cool. The dinosaur chase wasn't even that bad. But I mean, this part can just suck it. I mean, this is ridiculous. You should have, like, a mask that, like, freezes lava or something. Screw it. It 
it's so much fun. It's, it's actually, I mean, it really is fun, but no, not this part. It's making me sad. I know I said I liked his death animation, but not, not this much. Especially because you can't even see it, because he's usually in lava dying. That time I even made it through. 50, woo! Drink to that. That didn't even make sense, but all right. Oh, I thought I think I'm starting to figure something out. I say that every time, and then I don't. I think I think I can hold the slide button longer, so I don't have to like jump right out of it. If, if I hold it too long, I just slide right into the lava. Yeah, like that. But sometimes you have to hold it longer, otherwise you don't get enough distance. Damn it, I did exactly the same thing as the other time and it did not work. There's gotta be something in here I'm missing. Yeah, at least his scream is just so manly. Makes you want to soldier through. Uh, does, you need to make that little ridge a little bit higher or something, because it's, like, way too unforgiving. this is toward the end of the level. Like, uh, although, possibly there's a third dinosaur part. I don't know. So the dinosaurs kind of gave up pretty easy that last time. Who needs dinosaurs when you have pools of lava? almost the same thing every time. And, like, I know, it's like, why don't you do something different? Because a couple times, I did that same thing, and it worked fine. Like that. Or that. Or me hitting the options button by mistake. Now, this platform's gonna fall. Cut! Oh, I was through it! I was through it! Oh! That was the right placement, too. I needed that. Alright, we're good. We are good. Not even worried about it. It really is, but it works, though. Sometimes doing the slide move works. Come on! Give me a checkpoint, give me a checkpoint, give me a checkpoint! Yes! Oh, I don't even care. I don't even care. Let the freaking dinosaur eat me. That's fine. That's fine. I did it. I got past the stupid thing. I don't even- I literally don't care what happens now. I almost- I'm almost sad- okay, those mushrooms knocked you out. Let's try again. I'm almost sad that this doesn't count for my progress toward the real game, because I'm gonna have to beat that again. Oh, I'm gonna be so mad if there's a part where you have to do that while the dinosaur chases you. I'm gonna be so mad if that if that happens. And now the dinosaur can jump. Oh god. 
I knew I knew that was gonna fall, and by the time I figured it out, I was already on it. <sighs> but I don't care because I'm out of slidey platform hell. Come on. That's it. Beat it. Oh. Oh, God, Crash. I'm glad you can still be so debonair after that, because I am just... Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, Bex, you want to play this? I'll, uh... I don't really think I have a way to share it for you, but... Yeah, yeah, you, you want... You want to play this. This is a great game. Well, let's play as Cortex, because, you know, he always wins. No, his main thing is that he never wins. It is weird, and I, I, I mean, I wouldn't like it if I wasn't going to buy it already. I'm sure when the game comes out, they'll probably have the demo on for free on the store. This is probably just like an early thing for people who pre-ordered it. That's the main complaint I saw on Twitter, is that it should be a free service a free demo bandicoots are on route i must reach the spot yeah, they really don't want to <laughs> no plot spoilers there oh okay what, what am i supposed to do there okay so uh, i think i shoot my gun at them i think i do that I always thought Cortex sounds like uh, Kelsey Grammer, the guy who plays Sideshow Bob. Oh, that's funny. He turns into a devil. Yes, I do know that he can turn them into bumpers or whatever. Thank you. Platforming-wise, he's actually not too bad. I thought he was going to control, like, a brick, but he's not too bad. Oh, come on! Is that C for checkpoint or C for cortex? I'll tell you, I'd rather do this than the freaking lava thing again. further distance, but not as high. Gun seems like a... Oh! Forgot I had a dodge. Didn't have a double jump again. Gun reminds me of a... Oops. I can never finish my sentence. That gun reminds me of a, uh, like, Dr. Doofenshmirtz invention. It's the platformer Raider Raider. Looks like there's a lower route here. How am I supposed to shoot that thing if it's below me? Maybe I was supposed to go that other way.
Oops, so too far. Okay. Jump kind of blows. Oh. I see what to do. That was not what to do, but it worked. Oh, Ooh, why? Go! I thought there was something underneath there. I guess I gotta turn that last one into a springy one, maybe. I gotta start all the way back here now. Well, music's kinda cool. That one lava part, I have no complaints about the game. I do kind of wish they gave me a bit more variety in terms of the demo, but I know there's gonna be a lot of different level types in the full game. That was kind of cool. On a cold winter's night, have yourself a bite of bandicoot stew. Oh, jeez. Ugh, I'm not even like trying to beat this like, you know, completion style, like I'm just trying to survive. That's how he hits the button. Ah, oh, I'm playing a scratch again. Oh, I gotta do this again? Except this time it seems different. Ah, oh, now I wish I had the dash. So I get it. It's like his same level from Cortex's point of view, but like, why do I play as Crash Gun then? Alright, we get to watch me die as a different character now. Oh, 
those Wumper Fruits aren't going to help me where I'm going. That is so ridiculous. part I remember. This is pretty much exactly the same. Well, maybe not. I don't remember so many TNT crates. I was about to say I'm getting better at that, and then that happened. So whenever you think you should jump, like, wait maybe three seconds more. <laughs> like that. See, that would be my first guess, but that's usually wrong. Okay. This was a mistake, but I recovered it. Like, the first few times I played the other Crash games, I would die that many times, and then, I mean, I'm still not the greatest at them, but I don't die that often. That was going too well. Where do I go? Oops, shoot. Where do I go now? There's no clear direction there. thing, it's something else. Oh. Well, at least I see the way out now.
was close enough to hit him, but not close enough to get on the boat. I mean, this game gives you, like, no mercy. again. Why is there like no platforms now? Platform seems a little seem a little random. It is a long way back, that's what I'm saying. I mean generally in distance terms not really, but in the fact that I died so many times it may as well be in China. something behind the waterfall. Just an extra lump of fruit. So it basically seems like a harder version of Crash's level 24. With that other cortex part tacked in the beginning. Yeah, because that's the end of the level now. I missed a lot of those crates, but I don't care. Alright, so there's your demo. Three fairly difficult levels. I think, you know, the last the snow levels probably weren't as hard as I made them look. I just kind of sucked. But that, that lava thing was kind of ridiculous. So. Oh yeah, very, very easy. Very easy. I can only, can only hope those are the first two levels of the game. Because that's too easy for me. I need, I need harder stuff than that. Yeah, Crash looks happy. But, you know, regardless, I'll be picking this game up because I pre-ordered it. And, uh, yeah, we will see you then. And I think it's about time, hey -oh, for the PS5 showcase in a little bit, which I will not be streaming, but, uh, I will check that out. So, thank you for watching, and, uh, yeah, we will see you in the next one. <laughs> hey -oh. Not a problem. I'll feed us saying. <laughs>